Some of you might know that I wrote a, let's be honest, disturbing novel about a school shooting. And it's really the story of a kid who was pushed past a tipping point while a bunch of his peers literally stood by and did nothing. The title of the book, Bystanders, because we're touching on an issue here that's prevalent in our culture, and that is there's a bunch of kids who see bullying every day and they simply stand by. Dr. Martin Luther King said this, we will have to repent in this generation, not merely for the hateful words and actions of the bad people, but for the appalling silence of the good people. Is your kid a bystander? What do you do to help our kids understand how they can make a difference in kids' lives? Well, that's actually where it starts. It starts with us having conversations with our kids and helping them step into the shoes of other kids, helping them know that they can make a difference. Most research out there shows that bullying can be prevented by if you have one friend. Most research shows that depression can be prevented by if you have one friend. There's something about these studies that always have this one thing in common, one friend. And guess what? If we can let our kids know the power of simply befriending someone else, instead of being that bystander who just stands by, what if they stood up and said something? Or better yet, what if they actually sat down at lunch with a kid and got to know him and talked with him and became their friend? It only takes one. One kid can make a difference. Maybe that could be your kid. Are you having these conversations?